Welcome to my channel Uday's Review. In this video, let us see Asus Zenfone Max Pro M2 Android Pie Beta version update. I got this update through a telegram link. I will give you the link below in the description. Let's download. It is about 1.70 GB. As this is a beta update, the installing of the OS in your phone will be at your risk. Mostly by March, the full version of the update will be released. The update will take some time, so I am forwarding the video. Download is done and let us move the downloaded file to the SD card. So we can update manually from SD card. I have copied to SD card. It will take some time to copy. Friends, this video will be little long so bear with me. Let us see what version is it now. As we all know, it is running on 8.1.0. Let us see if the update has been copied to SD card. Yes, it is copied. I'll be shutdowning the phone and boot it to the recovery mode. We can go to the recovery mode by switching the volume down button and power button at the same time. Once the logo appears, leave the buttons. So this is the recovery mode of the phone. Let us select update from an external storage. Let us select the update. It will start installing. This will take some time. The update is complete and let us reboot the device. As the device is got and the beta pi update, the login will take some time. This is the first boot of the device. I'm sure the device has not lost any data because the wallpaper is the same what I was having before. Let us unlock the device and go into the device. After unlocking, we get a system update successful message. Let us see the updates. I can already notice the icons and the layout of the icons has been changed let me change to the default wallpaper and go into the settings i can see the icons have been turned into color which was not in the same before. Let us go to the system and about phone and see the update version. Android version is 9 and with January 1st 2019 security patch. This is a build number. Let us go to the animation of the Pi and we can see the Pi animation. Let us go into the update and see whether we have got any other updates. As of now nothing. And I will turn off the auto update. I 
I can see lots of changes in the device and I will give you the brief update version video in the next session. Let us go to the camera and see. This is the default camera. Nothing has changed in it. Nothing has changed in the back camera as well. Everything remains same. Icons have been changed here also. Let us open the Gcam and see whether it is working or not. When I opened the Gcam, it was not working in camera. I switched it to video mode and I got back to the camera mode and now it is working. Let us see whether night mode is working. As of now, it is not working. Maybe because this is an Apai beta update. So let us wait for the full update. Let me zoom in. Yes, it is working. Let me take a photo with a flash. Okay, it is working. Let me go to the portrait mode. It is not working. When I clicked panorama mode, app crashed. Let me reopen it and go to the videos and come back to the camera. The front mode is working now, which was not working before. That's all friends in this video. Hope you like this video. If you like it, just press the like button, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. In the next video, let us see in details of what has been updated and we can see if, if any bugs are there. Thank you friends. Have a nice day. Subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notification.